Hello, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I've been up from last night from, I heard the queen has passed away. And I haven't slept since. I've been crying constantly. I've been crying constantly. And it's very sad news. Even though she was 96, it's very, very sad news for me. It's very emotional and I have a slip. I mean I didn't know the Queen personally but I came into this country and I was hoping that one day I'll get to meet her. I'll get to meet her one day but obviously obviously the day has come and I still didn't get to meet her and now that she's passed. <laughs> I mean, when death come knocking, <laughs> when death come knocking, there's nothing you can do. You could be as wealthy and be the most wealthiest person in the world, but when death come knocking, there's nothing you can do about it. <sighs> so, it's just like my Uncle Bobby. We, when we was back home in Jamaica, my Uncle Bobby died. My Uncle Bobby, he didn't have anybody around him but us. And my Uncle Bobby, we didn't have money to bury him. We had to put him in a, in a wash tub, dig a hole in the back of the garden, at the back of the house in the garden, and bury him. We only had one flowers at the back of the garden. We had to chop down the flowers and put it on top of his grave. So Uncle Bobby, we bury him in a bathtub. <laughs> Obviously, it was an open casket because I could have one. It was an open tub, so we didn't have money to to buy a casket to cover it. So even when we was throwing the dirt down at Uncle Bobby, even though we was throwing the dirt on Uncle Bobby, if the dirt went in our mouth, because his mouth he died with his mouth open, so. Rest in peace, Uncle Bobby. But that being said and done, as I was saying, when that come knocking, no amount of money can save you. There's nothing you can do when that come knocking at you. He can come in the morning, he can come in the afternoon, he can come in the night, and he can come any time of the day. So, to Her Majesty, Rest in peace. You've been around a long time. And I wanted to meet you, but obviously I didn't get the opportunity. So, rest in peace. You'll be sadly missed. So will my Uncle Bobby, because I missed my Uncle Bobby. My Uncle Bobby used to steal. And he used to steal and look after us in the family. He used to sell his little weed, his little marijuana, and stuff like that. And when he passed, I lost a lot of weight. I was very, very skinny because he used to buy us chicken. And when he can't buy the chicken, he used to steal the chicken. So, Uncle Bobby, we sorely miss you. Now I'm in the UK. If he was alive... I would make you stop stealing, but obviously that time has sadly passed. So the queen is gone. The queen is gone. Oh Lord, the queen is gone. The queen is gone. Her Majesty is gone. Her Majesty is gone. Her Majesty. <laughs> so sad. 